why should we meditate? Yeah, we are saying these are all the things, you know, what meditation is, it's going to help you calm your mind and all that. Why should we meditate? Why the heck do we even have a class today for meditation? <laughs> why is it so important? Because our minds are restless. And when our minds are restless, so many bad things happen. So we need to calm down our thoughts. And there are so many benefits of calming our thoughts. That is a core reason. Okay. Many people think meditation is a religious practice. It is a spiritual practice. You are going to feel some, you know, out of world, you know, experiences and all those things. I don't know about any of those things. I'm talking as a physician, as a practical person, what can we do to reduce stress in our lives? Be calm, relaxed, so that we can focus, perform better, have better health. It is as simple as that. We talk just about restlessness, right? How many people are restless in this room? Let's say, are you restless? Sometimes. Sometimes. Are you restless? Yes. Now or sometimes? Not right now. Not right now. Oh, thank you. Wow, that's a great. <laughs> sometimes. You, Sharon? Right now? You're focused. You're not restless right now. Jerry, you're restless right now? Oh, okay. <laughs> He's the only one who is telling the truth. <laughs> you liars. <laughs> I'm going to prove you <laughs> that you are restless right now. You want me to prove it? <laughs> okay. So what I did was more than a decade ago, people... I figured out, you know, how people can identify if they are restless or calm. So I created this litmus test for restlessness. <laughs> so we are going to do it now. Okay, everyone in the room, as well as who are watching me from their home online. So let us take a moment to do this. Okay, sit down. And if you can sit down, it's okay. You can stand and do it or lie down, whatever position you are in, that's fine with me. Close your eyes. And this is what you're going to do. Start from 100. I'm going to give you one minute, maybe one and a half minute. Start from 100 and count back to one. In that process, you should not miss even one number. You should exactly know 100, 99, 98, 97, 96, 95. And then sometimes our mind wanders somewhere. You start thinking about, oh my God, I'm hungry. I want to eat something. Or I have something, uh, errand to run in a couple of hours from now. Whatever it is comes to your mind. So with in, none of those things should come to your mind. Just the numbers. Let's start now. Count down from 100 to 1. Okay, so, yeah, so tell me your experience. <laughs> okay, well, I'm very visual. Yeah. So I let the numbers roll from me. Yeah. And I stayed with every number as it came up. Very good. What about you? I did as well. I visualized them mm -hmm. so that I could stay focused on them. Um, I got down to 19, but I counted kind of slowly. I was distracted by some voices out mm. outside the room. Yeah. Bit, thinking, ooh, they should be talking right now. Mm. Um, but other than that, I was pretty focused on them. Oh, very good. Um, yeah, I, I didn't really visualize it, but I did get down to zero, and I counted down pretty quick, I think. Uh, tried to uh, isolate the noise. There wasn't a lot of background noise, which, which helped. 
Mm -hmm. uh, place, obviously, probably would have been more difficult for me to focus. So while you're doing this, you didn't think about anything else? Nothing else? Yeah. I wouldn't say nothing. I probably had a thought that went somewhere in the back of my mind about what you would say at the end. Yeah. And how you would process mm. Mm -hmm. so something was back there. Yeah, what about you? I mean, I, I had a couple of thoughts that popped in and then I just tried to go like right back to county when I realized that, oh, then I better go back to county down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you? Anything at all? I really took it seriously. Yeah. <laughs> I was really trying to focus on spending all my numbers. Good, good. So when you do this, this test for restlessness, you can use it anytime to check within yourself, how am I feeling? Am I able to focus? Or my focus is wandering from one thing to another. Most commonly, people have trouble going all the way from 100 to 1 because their mind goes somewhere else. And then we have to bring it back again. Go somewhere else, bring it back again. And it depends on the state of mind that you are in right now. Okay. So, a lot of times when I do this in conferences, the response is mixed. Some people are like, yeah, I'm able to count. Some people are like, I was thinking about what happened yesterday. <laughs> or what should I cook tomorrow? <laughs> so, so many other things. But there's a test that you could use anytime. The litmus test for restlessness.